Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you enjoyed last night's uh, entertainment. I hope you all behaved well. I hope you all found your way back into, hopefully, uh, your own beds. <laughs> Some of you uh, still look a little bit tired if I look around here. So I thought, why don't we start with a little wake up exercise this morning. And it is really intended to be an homage to Benjamin Zander's uh, session yesterday, which for many people I think was a truly life-changing session. So why don't you do me the favor and all get up for a second, please? <laughs> you know where this is going. <laughs> you know where this is going. The problem is your German is really not that great, unless you are German, right? So being German, I planned that. Can we please have the phonetics here? <laughs> and you all remember, let me do it once for you in German. Just a little practice round for the ones who might have missed last night's session, which really was a miss then. Freude schöner Götterfunken, Tochter aus Elysium. Wir betreten Feuer trunken, himmlische dein Heiligtum. Deine Zauber binden wieder, was die Mode streng geteilt. Alle Menschen werden Brüder, wo dein sanfter Flügel weilt. Are we ready to go? Well, <laughs> don't, don't be afraid, right? <laughs> don't be afraid. So I was, I was the kid, right, that the family laughed at at Christmas when he was singing, right? So <laughs> be loud, be proud, but I have a little bit of support. Can we please play the music and we just sing along? I hope everybody's awake. <laughs> I, would have never, I would have never thought in my life I would dare to ask a crowd like you to do something like this. So thank you again for Benjamin for setting um, the scene. So yesterday we looked at the broad uh, business issues facing the world and the difference that business leaders can actually make. Um, today we will extend this to looking at the shifting priorities and how to innovate and how to generate positive change amid all of this chaos. We also have, you might have noticed, a few younger faces here uh, in the crowd. I apologize for everybody <laughs> who doesn't feel to be a part of the younger faces. Um, because we have in parallel running something which we call the Zeitgeist Young Minds Masterclasses. And there's an information pod out there if you want to hear more about it. And also in one of the upcoming sessions, you see some of the greatest young minds that we have found uh, on, um, on stage. I'm also looking very much forward, please, to get feedback afterwards at the end um, of today. Give us very open feedback. Give us very honest feedback. Don't be too polite in doing that. <laughs> I have to tell this one story. <laughs> Politeness. I had a friend who had to give a speech in front of 1,500 people in China a while ago in English, and he didn't speak uh, Chinese. And so he gave the speech, and he was really afraid that his jokes actually would not work. So he gave the speech, everybody was laughing, it worked out perfectly. Later on, he saw his translator. He walked up to his translator, he said, you did an amazing job, and he hugged him. So the translator looked at him and said, well, to be honest, I knew your jokes wouldn't fly, I told him just to laugh. So, <laughs> <laughs> so, so please be open, we can digest feedback, please be open. Uh, we use it to actually uh, improve what we're doing here.